Hey everybody, my name's Caleb. And I'm Sarah. And today at church, we're gonna have a creation cooking challenge. That's right, we're gonna make something totally awesome out of all this stuff. It's gonna be so fun, and what's even cooler is that we're gonna learn something awesome about God. You guys ready? Let's do it. Let's go. Woo. All right, guys, today we're gonna learn about how God made the whole world. That's right, he made the whole world in just seven days. Awesome, and on day six, God made animals and people. Whoa, that's awesome. Let's do that together. On, on day, day six, six God, God made, made animals and people. And people. <laughs> awesome. Awesome job, everyone. Well, today we're gonna make some pancake art that's gonna remind us about how God made animals and people. We're gonna make some animals. Man, this is gonna be so fun. We're gonna use the pancake batter here with all the different colors to make pancake animals on this griddle. And we're gonna see who can make the best animals. Awesome. To get started, we're gonna use some of these ideas from this cup. We we don't even know what they are, so we're no. gonna find out. Are you ready? So ready. All right. All right, you wanna draw first? Y yes. Okay. Oh man, I gotta cover my eyes. Here we go. All right. I got a turtle. <laughs> a turtle. Oh my goodness, That's guys. So fun. All right. All right what see. are you gonna pull? There we go. I got a dog. Oh man. That's gonna be so fun. Okay, if you don't mind, could I have the cooking spray? The cooking spray and then also the green pancake batter. Yeah. Okay, here we go. You gotta make sure you spray it. So that doesn't stick. There you Perfect. Go. Thank you. Can't have sticky pancakes. Nice. Good job. All right, we gotta make sure these get nice and warm. Nice and boosty. It's getting cold out. Looking yeah. for a heater. And these get Use really hot. So if you're gonna make pancake art at home, yes. make sure you're gonna do it with a grown up because you do not wanna burn your little fingers. You have to do it with a grown up. So Let's we both need to share this black one. So we can outline our animals. So we can outline our animals. So you're gonna go first. Nice. Good. You're making a dog. Ooh, with big ears. Do you have a dog with big ears? I don't. I wish we had a dog. Oh, that'd be so cool. Make a little nose. Oh, nice. Wow, that was really That's good. So... All right, okay. you got it. Now I'm gonna try and make a turtle. This is really hard. Okay, here we go. You can do it. I'm gonna start with his head right here. And then I'm gonna make his arms. That looks good. Me a little bit more, and I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna make his legs, and then his other leg, and then I'm gonna go up here and try to make. Oh man, that's tough. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> that was, that funny. was awesome. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna do mine with the green. Okay, I'm gonna put that in here, and then over here, right here, over. Here. Yeah. Okay. okay. I think I need to poke this one again. Oh, got oh, a little man, bubble. That's getting jammed up. Okay, brace yourselves. To get it? Yeah. Just gonna go around the whole thing. I'm gonna call this dog Spot. I'm gonna call my turtle Bro. Jaw. Bro. Bro like the it. turtle. Bro. So the key is. Because you're gonna flip it, you want it to stay together. So you gotta cover the whole thing in layers so that you can still see what it is, but it will hold together. Now we're just waiting top. for bro to dry or bro bake. Bro and spot. Bro and spot. Woof. Chilling like villains. Except for the, the good guys, obviously. Okay, it looks like bro is almost done. We have to be really careful when we flip our pancake because it could break, okay? <laughs> <laughs> And then I'm just gonna go for it. One, two, two three. three. Oh! Wow. That's the best I can do, okay? It's a turtle. It's, it looks pretty It was good. my first try. Okay, yeah. Sarah, right. I, think, I think that you're getting close. All right, Spot, you ready, bud? <laughs> Sit, roll over. 
Okay, Both. which way are we flipping? Um, we want to flip right to left. Oh, <laughs> I guess we're going left to right. <laughs> no, we can't. Wait, let go. Ready? Have... Oh my gosh, Whoa. look at that. I think that we might need to try them though to make sure that they taste good. I'm going to see if I can get a... That was a bummer. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try it again, because why not? Here we go. Yeah, Ooh. good job. Okay, there we go. Good job. Well, bro. All right, I think we need some syrup. Okay, yep, let's do it. Just a little bit in the corner there, so I don't want to mess them up. I'm going to use a lot of syrup on mine. Do you guys like a lot of syrup? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, spot. Okay, now for the bite. Here we I go. See. Numbers, numbers, numbers. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Yeah. That's good. That is good. So for this one, we're gonna surprise each other, and so you're, we're gonna come up with our own animals, and we're gonna start drawing them on the griddle, and then the other person has to guess what animal they're drawing. You guys ready? You wanna go first? Sure. All you right. Ready? I'm gonna close my ears. Okay, I'm right. gonna tell you guys what I'm gonna draw so you know, but he doesn't know. Okay, Cover here we your go. Ears. You ready? I'm gonna do a pig. We're good? You're good, yeah. Okay, Okay. Do right. you know what you're gonna draw? I think so. Okay. Cover your ears. All right, guys, we're gonna draw a bear. Okay. Good. Okay, All right. good. Here you go. Thank you. You want the black one first? Sure, All right. thanks. Here we go. So that's a circle with a dot in the middle. Two dots, so it's eyeballs, maybe. Has a mouth. Maybe a person? No, because we're drawing animals. Oh, pointy ears. You, I'm going to start with mine. You can use black one now. Okay, here we go. I'm going to go like that. I'm going to go up like that. I'm going to go all the up. Oh, no. Got a little, got a little thing in there. Is so. that a mustache? <laughs> Is that, that really looks like sunglasses and a mustache. Well, you'll just have to see. So... I don't know any animals that have a mustache. All right. I think mine's ready to flip. What do you think? I think so, too. I okay. think mine's still waiting, but we could start with yours. Cool. I'm kind of worried about flipping it. If you need a third okay. one. Got a third one. One. Two. two three. three. Whoa! Whoa! That was way better than I thought it would be. Oh, that is it. so good. Okay, I think, do you think yours is ready, Flip? Okay, yeah, I'll flip mine first. Here we go. Okay. I'm gonna flip it that way, ready? Mm. One, two, two three. three. Whoa, Ooh. that was good. Okay. Okay, you can guess what you think mine is. All right, I think that you drew a pig. Yeah. I got it? You got it right, good Thanks. job. I think you drew a mouse. A mouse? No, I drew a bear. Oh! With sunglasses, because oh, I that. couldn't oh. disconnect his eyes. Cool! You ready to eat these pancakes? Oh, I'm so ready to eat these pancakes. I have to do my signature move, obviously. And I gotta flip it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, ready? Here we go. Whoa! Oh. That's pretty good. I didn't get all the way. But you didn't even break the animal. That was good. No. He's still there. I am just gonna do classic. I'm a little bit worried. Oh yeah, you Slide got it. it on there. So good. Oh yeah. I wish that, you guys were here to, to eat these. I know, and smell them, they smell so good. I mm. blow on it. Mm. Mm. Warm. Mm. Mm. That's mm. a good bear. If you've ever had bear before, this is good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat another one because it's just like, oh. These pancakes are so good. Who do we think the winner is? I'm gonna have to say that you are the winner because both times you were able to draw a really good dog and a really good pig. Huh, thanks. It was fun. And even though my pancake wasn't that great, you know, everything that God makes is always good. So let's check out our Bible story to see what God made on day six. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The earth was empty, formless, and dark, but the Spirit of God was there. On the first day, God said, let there be light. And God saw that the light was good. Then He separated the light from the darkness. 
God called the light day and the darkness night. On the second day, God said, Let there be a space to separate the waters of the heavens from the waters of the earth. God called the space sky. On the third day, God said, Let the waters beneath the sky flow together into one place so dry ground may appear. God called the dry ground land and the waters seas, and God saw that it was good. Then God said, Let the land sprout with every sort of plant and tree. And God saw that it was good. On the fourth day, God said, Let lights appear in the sky to separate the day from the night. God made two great lights, the sun for the day and the moon for the night. He also made the stars. God set these lights in the sky to light the earth and God saw that it was good. On the fifth day, God said, Let the waters swarm with fish and other life. Let the skies be filled with birds of every kind. And God saw that it was good. On the sixth day, God said, Let the earth make every sort of animal. God made all sorts of wild animals, livestock and small animals, each able to have babies of the same kind. And God saw that it was good. Then God said, Let us make man in our image, to be like us. So God created man in his own image. He formed man from the dust of the ground. He breathed the breath of life into man, and a man became alive. Then he saw that the man needed a helper, so God put man into a deep sleep. And while he slept, God took one of the man's ribs. Then God made a woman from the rib and brought her to the man. Hello. Hi. Wow, God is so powerful. That's right. God made all the animals and the people of the whole world. Everything that God makes is good. So, what did God make on day six? On day six, God made the animals and the people, and it was so good. Let's do that together. Here we go. On day six, God made the animals and the people, and it was so good. Great job, you guys. On day seven, God also rested. That's right. And when you guys go home, you're going to have these coloring pages that you get to take with you. And it has all the different days, and it reminds us about what God made each day. And on the front, we have something for you so you can go home and have a pancake art challenge with your family and friends. That's awesome. Be sure to tell your parents and your friends so you can do it together. We had so much fun hanging out with you guys today, and I hope you have fun worshiping God and learning more about Him. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.